Welcome to DIY Hair School and today I am going to show you all the products that I use to keep my hair shiny and healthy. Healthy hair is important for everyone no matter what hair type, whether you color your hair, if you don't color your hair, if your hair is straight, curly, fine, thick, thin, it doesn't matter. Taking care of your hair is really, really important and number one tip for making sure your hair is healthy is to start from the inside. So I'm going to show you products that you're going to use on the outside to help keep your hair healthy, but at the end of the day, having proper nutrition, having a healthy body, having balanced hormones and as little stress in your life as possible is going to help you have the best hair possible. When you are super stressed, when you have vitamin deficiencies, iron deficiencies, things like that, B vitamin deficiencies are all really hard on your hair, hormone imbalances, all of those things can cause thinning, shedding, dry, brittle, breaking hair, and no matter what you use on the outside, if you don't fix those things that are going on the inside, nothing is going to make your hair healthy. So if you are trying all the topical products that you can and you just feel like nothing is working, it's time to talk to your doctor and find out what's going on on the inside because your hair, skin, and nails are always a great indicator that something is just out of balance and not quite right in your body. All that being said, um, keeping my hair healthy is definitely a challenge. Not only do I have hair that is bleached every Every four to six weeks but my hair is very fine and moderately thin and it's hard to find the right products that are going to nourish my hair keep my hair looking its best and feeling soft but also not weigh my hair down and make my hair flat so these are the products that I use to do that and these may or may not be the best products for you but if your hair is similar to mine they are a great place to start to start with my everyday shampoo and conditioner is the Unbreak My Blonde by Matrix. This shampoo is specifically designed to help to strengthen blonde hair, hair that is treated with bleach to be blonde, and it is nourishing, it is super, super good at keeping my hair really healthy, but it definitely doesn't weigh my fine hair down, so I do love that. Now, if you have fine hair like me, but you do not have blonde hair like me, then obviously that's probably not the best shampoo for you, but I do love the Matrix brand in general for their shampoos and conditioners, and they typically will have the right shampoo for your hair. Their Mega Sleek is great if you deal with a lot of frizziness and you like to smooth your hair. Their Food for Soft is awesome at hydrating. Pretty much everybody with dry hair loves the Food for Soft. They do have their High Amplify, which is their volumizing shampoo. They have So Long Damage, which is if your hair is really damaged, which is a great alternative if you color treat your hair a lot, but it's not blonde. There are just so many great shampoos in the Matrix line, in my opinion and honestly I have used so many of them on my hair and I have never found any of them to weigh my fine hair down not even the super hydrating food for soft I do use that on occasion if my hair is feeling dry and it works every time so matrix shampoo and conditioner is awesome just find the right one for your hair and if you are blonde like me then their unbreak my blonde is an amazing shampoo for bleached hair so a normal shampoo day routine would be, be to wash and condition my hair and then once I am done I will always put in the Miracle Creator 20 from Matrix. This is a leave-in product. It's like a 20 different benefits. It's like smoothing, hydration, leave-in conditioner, heat protection, all of that. It's a great product to put in pre-blow dry and again does not weigh my hair down. Now I did have a client once who purchased this and then said to me she hated it because it made her hair feel greasy and disgusting and I was just could not figure out why because I use this on myself all the time and I use it on literally every single client I have before I cut and blow dry their hair. So I asked her how she used it and it turned out she was she, she felt like she needed a lot of product because she had a lot of hair, so she was opening it up and dumping it into her hand and putting a lot in her hair. Any product, if you put too much in, is going to make your hair feel weighed down. So number one thing, if your hair feels weighed down from a product that you've tried, before you discard the product completely, see if using less fixes the problem because often if someone is finding that a product is leaving their hair feeling dirty it is because they've used too much so i do love this it has got the heat protection i need for my blow dry and i just spray it through my mids and ends i don't really put it in my roots but i just spritz it everywhere 
and then I go ahead and blow dry. Even if I'm air drying, I still put this in because it has got great detangling properties and helps to reduce any frizz as my hair dries. If I am going to continue to heat style my hair, if I am going to flat iron, curl, anything like that, after the initial blow dry, which my Miracle Creator 20 had the heat protection for, then I typically go in with another heat protection. And the one I use the most often is the Super Finish Polishing Balm by Evolve. Um, I do really like this one. It has heat protection. It also has UV protection. It also smooths out any leftover frizziness or anything like that. Just leaves my hair feeling super soft, super shiny, and absolutely formulated really well for fine hair. It does not weigh my hair down at all. It does not make it look dirty. It doesn't make it look like this product in it at all. Again, I do use a small amount. I use it sparingly on my dry hair before I go in with any other heat tools. Next we have treatments and I do do a couple different treatments on my hair on a fairly regular basis. So when I am looking for a hydrating treatment, the one that I like the most right now is the Design Me one. It is the Puff Me Volumizing Treatment Whip. This one is the best treatment by far that I've ever tried for fine hair. It is actually a super hydrating treatment that absolutely makes your hair feel like butter, but does not leave your hair looking greasy and flat like most treatments do. It's got hyaluronic acid in it, so it helps to moisturize the hair, but it doesn't have any of the really heavy, heavy ingredients that some masks do that tend to leave our hair type looking really flat and limp. So I find a lot of fine hair people do avoid hydrating treatments because they can have such a flattening, dirty effect on the hair. But this one makes your hair feel like butter and it also helps to add volume to the hair. So I use this probably every third time I wash my hair and it has definitely helped my hair to be much more lustrous, shiny, soft, especially in these winter months. I also have a day where I do damage treatments specifically. So the first thing I do before I treat my hair for damage is I wash it with a clarifying shampoo. So it's really important, especially if you like to use a lot of products that you do clarify your hair on a regular basis. It helps to keep your hair from getting a lot of buildup. It helps to keep your hair fluffy and full. And it also helps any treatments and products that you use to help repair your hair penetrate more properly if you don't have a bunch of buildup on your hair. So clarifying shampoo is really important. This is the Undo Goo by Malibu. I like it because it is pH balanced for your hair. It doesn't leave your hair feeling super, super dry. The other one I really like, I don't have it with me right now, is the Olaplex 4C. So the Olaplex 4C or the Malibu Undo Goo are both great clarifying shampoos. They're very gentle on your hair. They're going to be really efficient at clarifying your hair for you so that your hair can receive all the nutrients that follows. So after I've clarified my hair, I do not condition that day and I go straight in with this little miracle bottle, um, K18. This product is absolutely essential for keeping your hair healthy. It does an amazing, amazing job. It just, it has completely transformed my hair and completely transformed the hair of so many of my clients that I have used it on. So this is 100% worth the investment. It is an expensive product. I will say that it is not cheap to buy. Um, I think a bottle this size runs $80, $75, something like that. Depends if what country you're in, but um, it is very expensive. You do not need a lot though. I literally, after I clarified my shampoo, I do not condition one little pump. I rub it through my hands just to make sure I can spread it, put it through my hair, wait four minutes, and then I add any leave-in conditioners, anything in style as usual. Now, this will not make your hair feel super soft and super supple. It is not a hydrating treatment or anything like that. It is a bond repair treatment. It is not protein. You are not going to snap off your hair by using it too much. That's not what it does. It is not a protein treatment. It is a bond repair treatment. If your hair comes in completely hardcore damaged and you use it, you might feel some immediate relief from using this product. For, but for the most part, if you have hair like mine, it is just something that's going to help keep your hair strong, help to prevent breakage, help to keep your hair from snapping off, which we know if you have fine hair, your hair is very fragile and breaks very easily. And using something like this that strengthens the bonds of your hair will definitely help your hair retain more length, not get split in so easily, and just overall look 
a whole lot healthier. The products that I use to keep my hair healthy, it's pretty simple. To some of you, it might feel like a lot of products because maybe you only ever use shampoo and conditioner. And to some of you, you might be surprised. Maybe that's not as much as you thought. Um, it doesn't feel like a lot to me. It's a routine that I've come down with. I wash my hair probably two to three times a week. And I do my K18 and clarifying treatment probably every sixth wash. I do my hydrating mask every third wash. And other than that, I just use my good old shampoo conditioner and my leave-in miracle creator if before I blow dry my hair and that's it and just being really 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 consistent with that taking a multivitamin making sure that my body is healthy is what helps to keep my hair healthy I hope that helps thank you so much for watching today guys leave me any questions in the comments and I will do my best to make a video to answer any specific questions that you have or just respond to you in the comments subscribe and like so you don't miss any more of my videos. I do post three times a week, every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and I post almost every day on TikTok and Instagram. Bye guys.